Former U.S. spy agency contractor Edward Snowden has more secrets to reveal that relate to Israel, according to Glenn Greenwald, the journalist who first brought his leaks to the world's attention. It's definitely the case that there are a huge number of very significant stories that are left to report. We've only had these documents for seven months, which given their volume and complexity is not a very long time. There definitely are stories left that involve the Middle East, that involve Israel. The reporting is going to continue at, at roughly the same pace as it's been happening. Among allegations aired by Snowden last year were that the U.S. National Security Agency and its British counterpart, GCHQ, had in 2009 targeted an email address listed as belonging to then-Israeli Prime Minister Ehud Olmert and monitored emails of senior Israeli defense officials. Israel played down the disclosures, but Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu said he had ordered a probe into the affair. Concerning matters published in the last few days, I have asked for an examination in the matter. In the close ties between Israel and the United States, there are things that must not be done and that are not acceptable to us. Last month, several Israeli cabinet members and lawmakers said news of U.S. spying on Israel was an opportunity to press Washington to free jailed Israeli agent Jonathan Pollard. The former U.S. Navy intelligence analyst was sentenced to a life term in 1987 in the United States for spying for Israel and a succession of U.S. presidents have so far rejected Israeli calls for his pardon.